Hey guys, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to run an existing Flutter application on Android emulator in VS Code. Now, in this tutorial, I already have Flutter SDK and Android Studio installed and my Flutter development environment set up. If you don't know how to do that, there's a more complete Flutter tutorial on this channel. You can find it in the description of this video. But if you simply want to run an existing Flutter project in your Visual Studio Code and run it on Android emulator, this tutorial is for you. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. First, let's go ahead and open your VS Code editor and go to extensions, type Dart, and click on the first search result and make sure Dart extension is installed. I already have it installed on my Visual Studio Code, so I'm going to go ahead and also type Flutter click on the first result and install the Flutter extension as well. Now to open an existing Flutter project in VS Code, go ahead and go to File, Open Folder, and in my hard drive, Projects are on C Drive in Projects folder. I'm going to open my Flutter Projects folder and inside that folder, I'm going to click on the project Hello World and click Select Folder. Doing this will open an existing Flutter project in VS Code. So this is going to set up a Flutter project in my VS Code. Now, what you want to do is click on this button in the lower right corner and go to Start Flutter Emulator. You'll see this notification launching Flutter Emulator and you can resize it and place it right over there. Now, one common error you're going to experience running Flutter for the first time is after waiting for Flutter Emulator to connect, you get this failed to launch Flutter Emulator. Emulator did not connect after 60 seconds. Now that happens because you need to wipe data and you do that by going to Android Studio, clicking on these three dots, go to Virtual Device Manager, select your Flutter emulator you previously set up here. And in these three dots, go to wipe data and then confirm by clicking the yes button. Now you can close this up and we're going to go back to our Visual Studio Code. Now go back to that button in the lower right corner where it says No Device and click Start Flutter Emulator in the drop down. Now we're going to be launching Flutter Emulator and you'll actually notice that it's running a little different after we selected Wipe Data from Android Studio. That's because it's actually connected to our app and in just a moment you'll see the emulator connecting to its home screen. All right, so at this point, what you want to do is locate your main.dart file in Project Explorer and right click on it and select Run Without Debugging. Then you're going to have to wait a while for your Flutter application to build and eventually it will just show up in Android emulator. And to test if it's actually working, I'm pressing the button here and as you can see, the counter number is increasing. Okay guys, so this is the basic process to running an existing Flutter app in VS Code on an Android emulator and I hope that this is helping someone out there.